Hey guys, Chef Jason Hill here, and today we're gonna grill artichoke. And there's a few things you gotta do to prep these guys up before you put them on the grill. So let's get started. First thing I do is I cut off the end of the stem. Then I'm gonna remove these loose leaves or petals down around the bottom area because this there's nothing edible on these guys. Next, you can either take a peeler or a paring knife and we're gonna remove the outer layer of the stem because the stem is actually an extension of the heart and is edible and very, very delicious. And like I said, a peel or two. Then for presentation, I like to cut the top portion off of the artichoke, go maybe about an inch of the way up. And you need a really sharp knife for this because artichokes are very tough when they're in their raw state. And then if you do have a few little spiny guys left, you can always kind of nip with some kitchen shears. Usually you get them all off when you cut the top off. Now very important, artichoke oxidizes very fast. So as soon as you cut this or trim them up, just rub some lemon juice on it to keep it from turning a yucky brown. All right, we can go ahead and cook this right now like it is, but for grilling, I like to cut them in half. So I'm gonna turn them upside down. And I'm just gonna go right down through the stem into the heart and right in half. After I cut it in half, we've got to remove the spiny choke of this thistle. And to do that, you just get your spoon in there and scoop it out because you're not going to eat that. Just kind of scrape it out. You could do this after we steam it, but I like to do it before. Okay, before we hit the grill, we got to steam them or you can boil them, but I just prefer steaming them. So I got my double boiler going here and they're going to steam from anywhere from 30 for 45 minutes. All right, I had the artichokes in there for about 45 minutes and they've been sitting so they're cool to the touch. You know they're done when these leaves just pull right off. And always keep an eye on your water level. If your water burns off, you're gonna have a smoky burnt mess. Before we hit the grill, I'm gonna brush these with some melted butter. I'm gonna do both sides, just a little dab. All right, we're hitting the grill. It's been preheating on high. We're gonna lay these down for about five minutes, just to get a little crispy, little char marks on them for presentation. Yeah. What do you think, sugar? You think you would like grilled artichoke? You like everything else I pull off this grill? All right, after about five minutes, I'm gonna pull them off the grill. Got some nice little char marks on there. They're done. To eat these, you pull off the leaf and you're gonna scrape the meat off of the petal with the bottom of your teeth. And the best part, after you eat the petals, you're gonna cut this guy up, which is the heart and the stem, and eat that. And it's the best part. Well, I hope you give this grilled artichoke recipe a try. And as always, thanks for tubing in. Mmm, it's one of my favorite things to eat.